hey guys how's it going welcome to another one of my videos so on this video guys what we're gonna do is I'm gonna continue um, sharing my uh, v VHS collection uh, mostly uh, John Wayne movies um, so I hope you enjoy that um, so here is the first one um, Sands of Iwo Jima and uh, it is based on World War two and I'm not sure of the year but um, looks like early like maybe the 50s somewhere around there um, and uh, Sands of Iwo Jima John Wayne next one we have is another John Wayne this one is when he was younger it's a double feature uh, the lonely trail and three Texas steers so here it is there's a, a young uh, John Wayne for you The Three Texas Steers. So, John Wayne. What I did, guys, is the reason I have so many John, John Wayne movies is because I went to a, to a thrift store. And uh, the, they were selling the whole bin. Like uh, a, a full, like, size uh, bin, a uh, tote, you know, whatever you want to call it. Um, of VHS uh, John Wayne movies. And they were really, really good condition. Somebody had donated them. And uh, the thrift store where I go pick up my VHS has them for like 25 cents each, each uh, VHS tape. So I picked them up, and uh, yeah, that's why I have. This isn't uh, John Wayne, but it's uh, the Brian Boys of Mississippi. And um, I think it's a musical group. I'm not sure. I never heard of them. <laughs> so yeah, it's a, it's like a concert type thing. Oh, so it's gospel. That's pretty cool. And then we continue here with another VHS. Sandra Bullock. Harry Connick Jr. Gina Rollins. Uh, Hope Flows. Probably like a 90s, mid-90s movie. Um, looks like a romantic type movie. So that's Hope Flows. A lot of, you know, what's funny about collecting VHS tape, guys, is that a lot of uh, movies I've never heard of. <laughs> I have never heard of them. So we have, here we have uh, Steven Seagal. Um, marked for Death. So it's, it's when Steven Seagal was huge. You know, back in the 90s. Um, early 90s. Mid 90s. Uh action-packed you know so this is Steven Seagal and then here's another one catch me if you can if you if you can't win the race move the finish line <laughs> so I'm not sure this isn't the one about the banker who stole the or the guy who would rob banks and stuff this is a different one this looks like an 80s, maybe early 80s movie. So, catch me if you can. I want to say who's in here. Matt Langingal. I can't pronounce his last name. Yeah, so it's just actors that, you know, never really made it that big. Um, last one, guys, that I want to share here is... Uh, Rage in Harlem. I don't know if this is supposed to be like a part two of Harlem Nights, because um, I recognize her as part of the movie Harlem Nights. Um, this was obviously from a video store, as you can tell from the plastic here, the the cover. Um, Rage in Harlem. Forrest Whitaker's in it. Gregory Hines, Hines, Gregory Hines, Robin Gibbons, Robin Gibbons. And Danny Glober. So, like I said, I'm not sure if it's supposed to be like a second part to um, to Harlem Nights with Eddie Murphy, but um, definitely looks interesting to check out. I've never seen this movie, um, but yeah, I'll check it out. Um, thank you guys very much for watching, guys. My uh, VHS collection, guys. My videos. Um, please consider subscribing uh, if you enjoy these type of videos. You guys have a good one. Signing off.